The Metropolitan Museum in New York is one of the most famous art museums in the world. The Queensland Art Gallery has been able to display some of their most historical works of art. We spoke to curator Angela Goddard to see what she had to say. The Met exhibition, what exactly is it all about and how long will it be displayed here at the Queensland Art Gallery? The exhibition comes as a result of a collaboration between the Queensland Art Gallery, the Metropolitan Museum in New York and Art Exhibitions Australia. It's one of the largest loans ever uh, to leave the Met for an overseas institution. So could you tell us the difference between, for those of us who are artistically uneducated, the difference between Impressionism, American Impressionism and Realism? Well, American Impressionism comes through the European Impressionists, so artists such as Monet, uh, Degas, uh, Manet, these artists were looking towards these uh, originators of the movement uh, in France. The American Impressionists take what they have learnt from artists such as Monet, Manet and Degas and translate it into their own context. I, I saw some Australian works of art here in this exhibition. Why do you have those here? The curator from the Met, H. Barbara Weinberg, was very interested in the parallels between some of the experience of the American artists and Australian artists of that time. Australian artists, as well as the Americans, saw Europe as a place to complete their artistic education. So they studied under the French uh, masters in an atelier system. They studied together alongside each other and some of them became very close friends. So both countries, artists from both countries, took these experiences back with them into their own home situations. Is there a particular painting that's your favourite and why? Well, for me, I, I was thrilled to be exposed to the work of Mary Cassatt, which we really haven't seen much of uh, within Australia in terms of exhibitions or loans and there, there's a number of works by her in this show. She's a fascinating figure. Um, she was exhibited with the original uh, Impressionists in Paris in the 1870s, and she was a great friend of Degas, so she was really involved with a lot of the first uh, movement of Impressionism in France. I heard there's some like children's programs here available during this time and also some film screening. Can you tell us a bit about that? Well, the gallery is now really well known for our, our kids' programs and for this show we have uh, kids' audio tours which people can download. There are kids' labels which parents can explain to their children within the exhibition and what's going on in some of the works as well as a dedicated children's activity space where they can uh, draw and make their own responses to the show. We also have an extensive film program which looks at uh, the costume drama as a genre and uh, some period pieces that were set within the times that this exhibition looks at. American Impressionism and Realism, a landmark exhibition from the Met, is showing at the Queensland Art Gallery until September 20.